guys it is finally happened of course last night you guys already know about all the trades that occurred last night especially with the timberwolves and the rocks of course clink capella heading over to the hawks and the rockets i guess the plans to play pj Tucker at center i don't know but we're all this we're here to talk about andre Iguodala. according to Woj and espn sources from Woj, of course Memphis has agreed to trade Andre Iguodala to the Miami Heat, and I bet Jean Morant and Dylan Brooks are doing some dances right about now. Now, I feel Iggy was completely wrong in this entire approach, because personally, I feel like if you love basketball the way that you should, you, you shouldn't just sit out. Like, I don't even think LeBron or, or KD would do that. But hey, at the end of the day, Buddy got traded. Honestly, this is good for both teams. It's not really revealed what was traded yet, but it does say that Iggy has also agreed to a two-year, $30 million extension in Miami. Somehow, this dude took a W. Um, yeah, I don't... It's kind of weird for me because it's like, Iggy can definitely help out a championship team, especially a team like Miami with a bunch of veterans, but I don't think he's worth 15 million a season. That's just me, and he hasn't played a game in a long, long time. So I really want to see how this actually goes. Let me know what you guys think about this trade in the comment section below. I'll be updating the comment section as the trade details comes. But Iggy is officially a part of the Miami Heat. Him, Jimmy Butler, uh, Tata Tyler Hero, Bam out of bio. Really solid team, if you ask me. But is this, is this team good enough, even with Iggy, to make it out of the East? And let me know. And I'll be dropping some more breaking news stuff as more, you know, trade deadline trades, uh, you know, occur. Especially the blockbuster ones and the big ones like this one. But other than that, I'll see you guys then. I'm out. Peace, y'all.